Hello world, today I'm going to show you how to generate an SSH key and upload it to GitHub. For this video, I will be using Linux as my operating system. The first thing you're going to need to do is to open up a terminal and check to see if you have any SSH keys already installed in your computer. Type in this command on the terminal and hit enter. You may see something similar to this after entering the command, and that's okay. Generally, SSH keys will follow this kind of naming convention. They will be .pub files. If you enter the command that I just showed you, and you see any files that look like any of these that are appearing on the screen right now, you can upload one of these keys to GitHub if you choose to do so. The next thing we're going to need to do is to actually generate our key, assuming we want a new one. After entering the command to generate the key, you will be asked where you want to save the new key. It's best to use the default folder. Just hit the enter key. It'll ask you for a passphrase. You can leave this blank if you want to, but it's highly recommended that you enter a passphrase. Then it will ask you to confirm the passphrase that you just typed, and then it will give you a unique fingerprint for your key. This is not the key itself, it's just a string of characters to help you identify the key that you just created. If you use the ls command again, you'll see the files that were just created in the ssh directory. The next thing we're going to need to do is to start up the ssh agent. If the command to do so worked, it will give you a process ID number. It will not necessarily be this ID number that you're seeing on the screen now. You will probably have a different number. Then you're going to need to add the key to your SSH file. Type in this command and it'll do it for you. It'll ask you for a passphrase. And now the next thing you're going to need to do is you're going to open up the public key with your favorite text editor. In this case, we're going to use kwrite. After opening the file, it'll look like an unintelligible string of characters, and that's okay. You're just going to need to copy all of the text you see here, hit Control A, then Control C, and then open up a web browser and go to github.com. You're going to need to sign in with your user credentials. After signing in, click on the profile icon at the top right corner of the screen. Click on Settings. Then on the left side of the screen, click on SSH Keys. Then click the button that says add SSH key, give your new key a title, and then paste the key that you just copied from the text editor into the web browser. At the bottom of the screen, click the green add key button. And now your key should appear in GitHub. You can test this on the command line. Type in this SSH command to confirm if the key works. And if it works, you'll see a message similar to this one. And now you're ready to use your GitHub repository. I hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching.